Hello, my name is Benjamin Hart. I'm an American attorney and the managing director of Integrity Legal here in Bangkok, Thailand. As the title of this video suggests, we're discussing working outside of the parameters of a Thai work permit. So I thought of making this video after reading a recent article from The Phuket News, that's thephuketnews.com. Article is titled, Chinese Women Arrested at Phuket Airport for Working Illegally. Quoting directly, immigration officers have arrested two Chinese women taken into custody in the car park at Phuket International Airport for working illegally. Quoting further, the two women were arrested for, quote, working without a work permit or performing duties beyond the limits of those permitted, said the report. So, okay, what is the difference there? We all can understand, okay, working without a work permit, you come to Thailand, you engage in employment activity, you don't have a work permit. Yeah, that's a clear violation. You need to have a work permit. However, what happens if you come to Thailand, you have a work permit, but it specifies certain business activity, or, and this is more important, you're over in the restricted occupations list. That's a big one. The restricted occupations list can result in operating on the restricted occupations list specifically, doing something that's on that list. That's a clear violation of Thai employment law. Can again, result in arrest, deportation, possible blacklisting, fines, even, uh, even detainment, detention, if so prescribed. But that being said, the thing to understand about this is, yeah, just because you have a work permit doesn't mean you can do everything and anything. There's a very long list of restricted occupations in Thailand, and Thai authorities are serious about it. The employment office, the immigration department, again, I know there are those that would say, well, that's protectionist, they're, trying, they're insulating their labor force. Yeah, they are. We are. I, you know, I'm Thai too. Yes, that's what's happening. Now, I, I would argue maybe places in the West could take a page from Thailand's book on that when it comes to certain things. But leaving that aside, it just is what it is. And understand, if you're going to come to Thailand as a foreign national, you're just going to have to deal with this regime regarding employment law here in the kingdom.